published 1400 EDT, 21 October 2017 Updated 1400 EDT, 21 October 2017 Shrewsbury stayed top of Sky Bet League 1 after a late header from Aristide Nziala gave them a 10 win over Fleetwood. It looked like the Shrews were set to be frustrated before Nziala nodded in from a corner with just two minutes left. Wigan remained two points behind in second after coming from behind to beat Blackpool 31 at Bloomfield Road. Aristide Nziala celebrates his last Gisp winner for Shrewsbury against Fleetwood Nziala's header settled a 10 win and stole the points from their visitors at the death Kyle Vassal had put Blackpool ahead from close range after eight minutes, but Jade Dunkley headed the Latex level on the stroke of halftime before grabbing his second after 54 minutes to turn the match around. Substitute David Perkins added a third with eight minutes left. At the other end of the table, bottom club Plymouth recorded a first league win since August as Joel Grant's 64th minute goal proved enough for a 10 victory at AFC Wimbledon. Meanwhile Joel Grant scored the crucial goal for Plymouth securing their first win Ewan Doyle scored twice as new Oldham boss Richie Wellens marked his first game since taking permanent control with a thrilling 44 draw at MK Dons. Craig Davies gave the visitors a seventh minute lead, but Alex Gilby swiftly equalised. On Lynn Preston forward Doyle put Oldham back in front after 39 minutes, before making it 31 in first half stoppage time. The home side restored hope with a free kick from Edward Upson after 56 minutes, but Oldham soon regained their 12-goal cushion through defender Peter Clark. Aiden Nesbitt set up an anxious finale with nine minutes left, and Upson slotted in a dramatic equaliser after 89 minutes. It also finished all square at the Kassam Stadium, where Oxford and Rotherham shared six goals. The Millers went ahead after 20 minutes through Joe Newell, only for the hosts to reply immediately when Jack Payne equalised, and Josh Ruffles put them 21 up on the half hour. Ryan Ledson then saw his penalty saved before Curtis Nelson extended the US lead in the 40th minute. However, Ryan Williams pulled one back for Rotherham and Kiefer Moore leveled things up again with his 11th goal of the season after 78 minutes. Gillingham were condemned to a fur defeat in five games thanks to Matt Grimes' free kick Northampton 1-21 at fellow strugglers Gillingham threw a Matt Grimes free kick after 72 minutes. Daniel Powell struck a minute before halftime to put the cobblers ahead, but Gill's skipper Lee Martin equalised just after the hour before Grimes dealt the winning blow. Charlton moved level on points with third-placed Bradford after a clusterage effort from Jake Forster Kasky with 18 minutes left secured a 10-win at Valley Parade. Blackburn beat Portsmouth 30 at Ewood Park with goals in each half from Bradley Dack and Danny Graham. Rovers substitute Dominic Samuel was sent off with three minutes left before Craig Conway scored a third. Lee Martin celebrates his Gills equaliser before being silenced by Grimes late on informed midfielder Erhin Ozchumer struck twice as Walsall 130 at Doncaster. Ozchumer broke the deadlock just after the hour before tapping in his eighth goal of the season after 66 minutes, with substitute Kieran Morris adding a third with 10 minutes to go. An early goal from midfielder Matt Dunn proved enough to give Rochdale a 10 home win over Bristol Rovers. Scunthorpe came from behind to beat Peterborough 21 after Josh Morris' penalty four minutes from time stole the points. Posh broke the deadlock after 51 minutes through Gleon Edwards, but Lee Novak headed in an equaliser after 79 minutes, swiftly followed up by Morris. A day of drama and late goals was concluded at Roots Hall as Ryan Leonard scored a late winner as Southend sent Barry away packing with a 10 win.